Aman from Informatica Tech and today I am going to show you how to edit the Hobbit intro template. It's very easy to do, just follow the steps. Ok, before we start, please give this video a like and comment to show us your support. Ok, for editing the template, you will obviously need the template. If you have already downloaded, it's ok. If not, the download link will be now appearing on their screen. After you download the template, you will get a zip file named Hobbit Intro. Then you have to extract that zip file, then you will get a folder. Its name will be also Hobbit Intro. Then open that folder. Then open the fonts folder in it. Select all the fonts, right click and click install the fonts. Then go back, then open the Photoshop Hobby Text folder, open up the Photoshop file. After it opens, just delete the template layer and the layer. Then select your text tool, select the text, Hobbit, then insert your text. text and then be sure to place the text at the center of the screen because it's going to reduce your work in Sony Vegas. Ok. Ok, if you have any secondary text, just select the text tool again. In the, um, just click anywhere on the screen, in, write your text. For now I am writing here your text to then right click in the text layer means echo then co click on copy layer style select the new layer then right click in the new layer and select paste layer style it's going to paste the same layer style as now place the text at the right position you want for now I am placing here at below here now if you want to the text to be Align to the from here to here. Just se select your text tool, select the text, open up the character option. Okay, it's done. And note. I have used a pattern here, if this pattern is not showing up here on your photoshop then go to file, then go to open, then select the copy intro folder, then go to the textures folder, then select the gold stone. After the pattern opens, just go to edit define pattern and just click ok then return to a text layer then for now I am disabling this pattern right click on the text layer on your text layer then go to blending options and go to pattern overlay then choose the blend mode to normal opacity 100% choose that pattern and scale it to 35% it's according to the uh, text means the horizontal scale of your text so it is so 35% will be fine and click ok then save, then save the photoshop file by pressing ctrl plus s then exit the photoshop go back now open up the After Sony Vegas opens, then it will ask you that the following file could not be found, specify a new location. Obviously, it will ask you for the uh, Photoshop file first, just now we have edited. Then just click on specify new location or a replacement file, then click OK. Select the Photoshop file, then it will show you the same files are found in the same location. Do you want to use that location? Then select yes to all. Then it will ask you some more files, just click on ignore all missing files and leave it online, then click OK. After it opens, 
just scroll down and expand layer 8 it will be already expanded then click on the generated media button to edit the text after it opens select the text and your text then scroll up and open layer 1 and layer 2 then delete the text in the layer 2 then click on the generate media button in the layer 1 then your text 2 then close it then hold control button from your keyboard or command in mac then select the text layer and then drag it below it just at the right position select create a new copy of the source media then click ok now it's going to work now scroll down again and open layer then you will see two more text layers then edit this layer just click on the generated media button again your text 3 then select another then click on generated media button then your text 4 now it's all done just I hope you guys enjoyed the video and you guys have learned how to edit the template. If you are facing any problems, just write in the comment section below. I will help you out. Okay, thank you guys for watching.